Hello everyone, welcome, welcome. Today, make sure I'm in the right one over. We're going to not do hard modes. It's true, it's like five nights at 10 hours in there. Yeah, I know. Um, almost platinum. I am like 32 achievements away, and I consider that close. I consider that almost. So today, let's... Uh, let's play Samson. Let's try to break this stupid losing streak I've got going on. By, by winning as Samson. I guess it doesn't matter which direction we go. We'll decide on the fly. And figure it out then. It depends on if the run is going to be a strong run or not. Like, if it's a strong run, we'll go down to the dark room. If it's not a strong run, we'll go to the cathedral. Or the, the chest. One of the two. Something or other. It's just gonna take us some time. And we're not doing this on hard mode because I've been slamming my head against hard modes the past couple of nights. And, oh my god, that trite needs to calm himself down. Given how many achievements there are, yeah. I mean, out of 178, I need 32. So, I'm getting pretty damn close. Hey, a golden key. That's totally not useful on this floor. Um, we will try to do the boss rush. I mean, I, I don't make any promises on it, but we'll try. But first, is this an XL floor? No, it's not. But first we need to find our item room. And I'm gonna try to play decently, unlike the past couple of nights. <clears throat> So hey, is it just me, or does anybody else see the hearts that fall on the ground? And I mean the full- oh, sad bombs, that's so good. And I mean the full hearts, of course, not the, um, not the, um, partial hearts. But does anybody else think they look like tongues? I think they look like tongues. They look like a really pointy tongue. Ugh. I mean, I might just be insane. That's entirely possible. I want that black heart. Hell? He just like zipped on out of there. Um, since we're here and I don't want to backtrack and there is a half heart, I'm gonna just go in here now. Oh god, not worth. Not worth my time. <laughs> yeah, they look like a tongue that's sticking out. Like a very pointy tongue, of course, but it does look like a tongue to me. Who knows? Maybe I'm just weird. Which is entirely possible, because I am weird. Okay, so the secret room should be right here. And it has a golden poop in it. Alright. Counterfeit penny. Let's see if I can get all three of these guys. Nope. I only got one of them. Fuck it. I'm not going to waste my bombs. I like my bombs too much to waste. But I will check for the top secret room. It should be right here. It's not. Alright, whatever, whatever. Let's fight Gemini. I feel like it'd be cool if Gemini had a chance to actually drop Gemini. Yeah, yeah. Don't don't push that too far away. Thank you. So that soul heart will be awesome on the next floor. I am weird, but they do look kinda like tongues. Yeah, I know. I'm extremely weird. Pointy tongues for everyone. Does the in-out trick still work to increase the blast radius of bombs? I don't think it does, but it feels like it does, so I do it half the time anyway. Because it just, it feels like it does. Can you get, like, fucking locked against a wall, please? You're really frustrating me here. Okay, there we go. So we're at full health, damage, and shot speed up. Let's go to the next one. I'm gonna... Just my, I'm gonna itch under my hat, so I'm gonna just take it off and put it on my chair. Okay. So, Curse of the Unknown, that sucks. Now I can't see our health, which means that I cannot take any damage because I do not trust it. Hey, Pride, could you drop uh, the Anarchist Cookbook? Kept doing it for a while, but you didn't really see the difference. Yeah. Uh, I'll use that because I can. Chuk, chuk, womp womp. I love the cellar no, music. Oh god. I like the cellar music. It's pretty awesome. So let's go into our secret room. Thank you, Sad Bombs. You are awesome. Three whole pennies. Thanks, game.
Alright, come on. Get destroyed, boop. So, we do have keys, which is good, because it means that we can go right into our item room. We don't have to worry about it. It's just a thing that we can get right into. Nope, nope. And hopefully we'll get something good. Like, I don't care what, as long as it's good. Uh, homing shots. Homing shots are pretty good. Spoon better is pretty awesome. Womp. Womp, womp. Oh, interesting. So, now we can go to the shop as soon as we... I would love to do it with a bomb, but I'll, I'll do it with the key. I'll do it with the key. Why not? So, let's see what we get. We get the black candle. So, no curses for us. Thank goodness. And I'll even donate this extra penny. I'm really happy to get the black candle because, you know what? Fuck curses. Seriously. Fuck them. Alright, fatties. You need to die. <clears throat> oh, hey, we can see our health now, which means that we can go in here. Teleport. Cool. Uh, I will take both of these in an effort to become Guppy. I mean, Guppy's tail is pretty much terrible, but I'll take it. I'll take it because it's a Guppy item. Huzzah! Oh, that's my phone. Let me put that on silent. And here's your seed while I'm doing this. I'm fighting with it because the screen doesn't always work. So I have to hit it until the screen decides it's going to cooperate. Come on, you piece of shit. It's a terrible phone. Like, because it's old. And I mean, old for a phone. You know, the back doesn't stay on and the screen doesn't always work. You know what? I'll take the battery out. Just take the battery out. So there's your seed, now that we're thinking about it. <laughs> yes, we must all approve of the guppy. Including my phone. But my phone has always had good timing. It's just good like that. So, I'll turn it back on later. Like in between runs or something. Uh, no. Go away. I don't like you. So we have taken a ton of damage, but now it doesn't matter because, like, we've already got our devil room. But look at all this extra damage we're getting thanks to the way Bloody Lust works now. Okay. Down we go. But yeah, the back doesn't stay on, and the screen doesn't always work. It's, it's a terrible phone. It's old. <sighs> Okay, let's go. Kill some wall creeps. As they're apparently called. Excuse me? So, I kind of want to get Brimstone because of the homing. Or technology, maybe. But not Litovico. I would definitely pass Litovico with homing, because it's really annoying. You're constantly fighting against the, the item itself. So we'll skip Litovico if we... If that's even an option, but we will take Brimstone or something, if given the choice. My phone isn't a mobile rotary phone. It's just shitty. Because it's, you know, it's a cell phone, and they kind of crap out after like a year. Because design flaws or something, I don't fucking know. Three more pennies? Alright. Oh, four more pennies, I like it. We're rich. Okay, five more pennies. You know what? Let's go see what's in here. Let's see what's in here. Used our last sad bomb for it. Um, I really want Pandora's box. I really do. So we're gonna hope we get four more cents. Because it is totally worth it to just carry on for quite a while. You know, like a wayward son. I'm not, I'm not going to apologize for that reference, because I love that song. And I need to watch the new season of Supernatural that's on Netflix. Now that I think about it. Anyway! <laughs> totally off topic there. Half heart. Alright, let's fight this boss. We are going to get, hopefully, a cube of meat here, which doesn't... It won't mean anything, but we can pretend. 
still doesn't still haven't independently worked out what Pandora's box does. It gives you uh, certain items depending on the floor. Each different floor gives you a different set of items, but it's best to keep to like the cathedral because it gives you um, like god room items. If you want, you can totally go and find what floor is the best floor to use it on for me and paste it in the chat, and I would love you forever. But you don't have to. I'll have to make a, a thing for that. Or whatchamacallit, um, with Nightbot. With the wonderful bot. So, uh, kind of hoping that we'll get money here. But also really hoping, damn it. Damn it. Oh, come on. But also really hoping to get, um, more guppy pieces. A teleport to the devil room. That's what I was trying to think of. Teleport to the devil room. Oops. But yeah, the the item you get, the items you can get, are totally tied to... Uh, I'll use a key on that. That was not worth it. Well, I mean, I got a bomb, so I guess it was kind of worth it, but not very. Um, yeah, it gives you certain items depending on the floor you use them. Sometimes they're really good, sometimes they're really bad. But, I mean, if I don't get it, it doesn't matter. I'm kind of slingshotting this thing around. Whoops. Oh. Cleared that room for another bomb. So, it looks like we're not going to have enough money for it unless we bomb the uh, donation machine, which I am totally going to do. I only need two pennies. I'm going to bomb it. It's going to be a thing that happens. Let's see if we can get close enough to get that guy, too. Nice. Yep, you're mine. And um, let's donate the rest. Get it back up to 555. Five, five. No, I said 555, five, five, damn it. <clears throat> Alright, so we got our Pandora's box. We can leave. We can leave. Basement cellar is two soul hearts. Basement two is two bombs and two keys. Alright, what does it do in the caves too? Since that's where the floor that we're gonna be on is caves too. And catacombs too in this case. Oops. I am so glad that that worked. Um, hold on a sec. I will read as soon as I finish killing these keeper heads. Caves Catacombs 2 is one boss room and two soul hearts. Yeah, I'm gonna save it. Uh, turns out you are farther from platinum than you thought. Turns out that you still need to find missing no raw liver, black lotus, and secret rooms. Oh dear. Those are kind of a pain. But, I mean, just play enough games and you'll get it. Uh, okay. So I should definitely save it, because none of those... Those look very good. Hey, squirts. I'm gonna kill you. Bloop. Dodge that shit. I'll dodge that poop. Interesting. Womb your utero is probably... Oh, they use it on that and it always gives you the Bible? That's interesting. That is very interesting. I'm reading what it does because someone's pasting it in chat. But I'm not gonna read them all out because it's just... an. an a ton of uh, information that, you know, no one really needs, because it's not important right now. <laughs> Needless to say, on this floor, it would give me one boss room item and two soul hearts, and I don't really care much for that. Okay. Let's get away from there. There's our item room. Awesome. Gotta love me some item rooms. I think that guy explodes, I think. Yep. Had a feeling. Um, I don't really want this guy. Let's drop him right here in case the secret room is there. It is not. Whoops. Room 1 or Cathedral and Shoal. Yeah. Those are the best choices, really. Alright, can I not continue taking damage, please? Me? Can we stop? 
What is Twitch doing this time? Other than just being a terrible service most of the time. Shit. Okay, I gotta be careful now. Death card. Death card is good. Screw you. Let's take this back. Not step on a spike like a dumbass. Okay. Wow, aggressive chargers today. Like, holy damn. Okay. Soul Heart, thank you. So good. Alright, Carrion Queen is not my friend. I don't like her. I don't wanna I don't wanna deal with her. So I'm gonna shoot her in the butt. It's gonna be magnificent. How much shot in the butt she gets. <clears throat> no, no, no. I need to shoot you in the butt. Stop moving away. Alright, here comes the annoying part of the fight. I don't know how I didn't get hit there. I hate this fight so much. I mean, that's true of any fight that you have to shoot them in the ass. I hate them. But still. I hate this fight. And it's just eaten into time that I could be getting to the boss rush during. There we go, finally. We did get a double room, which is great. And it has goat head. Perfect. And I'm not going to take the knife because, like I said, I want to keep my homing. I want, like, brimstone or something. So, yeah. Have I done everything? I've done everything I'm going to do. I'm not going to go to the shop. Took six minutes to get video in addition to audio. Holy God, that's terrible. I'm so sorry. I wish I knew how to fix that. That's not worth my time. Yeah, we got to hurry. We're going to miss this boss rush. Yeah, let's see if this gets in. Well, it paid for itself in bombs. Only cost me one key, so it's not bad. Oh, look at the bonies. They're trying to trying to throw shit at me, and it's just it just goes straight into the gravity grimace. That's awesome. Get get dead, man. I don't like you. So we found our item room. Awesome. Got a bunch of money. <sighs> this is taking too long. You take too long to kill, man. Alright, so now I'm interested in the shop. Oh, hey, look, little brimstone. You're so good to me, little Brim. Now, obviously, taking damage doesn't matter anymore, but I still don't want to, given the choice. But we'll see what happens. Ow. Alright. Fine. Be that way. Just use a little brimstone a whole bunch, then. Whoa, he got pushed away. That sucks a whole bunch, so buy our second trinket spot. Let's blow this guy up. Spiders. Damn. I was really hoping to get that soul heart. That's okay, though. No. No tinted rocks? That sucks. Hmm. Alright, so this is worth it. Let's see what this pill is. Speed down. Oh, fuck you, game. Now, this is also worth it because it's a tinted rock. And we found ourselves a crawl space. That's apparently what it's officially called, is a crawl space. So we found the secret room and a crawl space. I'll check that out. Hit 
If you use a D6 in a secret room, will it become another secret room item, or does it D6 just make it anything? Usually they roll from the same pool. And I was not paying attention and lost my soul heart. Yeah, it should become another uh, secret room item. So what's in the crawl space? The crawl space has uh, sissy long legs. Okay. I'm okay with that. She will spawn spiders for us sometimes. Because she loves us. She does. And we need to hurry so that we can make this damn boss rush. Oh, perfect. There's the boss room. Oh god. Got myself stuck. Got myself stuck. Health up is good. It means we can afford more things from the devil room. Oh, and it's the adversary. Damn it. I hate the adversary. So annoying. He's such, uh, just a terrible boss. Dead. Here's some shot speed up. Not bad, not bad. What do we have in here? We have Krampus. Oh, Why couldn't you have been guppy items? Alright, let's see. Pie's like taking the insides of a thing out of the insides of a thing and put them inside of a pie. Oh my god. That's horrifying. Um, let's do this. Just to oh god, yes, perfect. I'm so glad I went in here. So we get double item or double of everything now. And since we're not playing on hard mode, we'll actually get stuff. Yay, stuff! So let's see. Stars card. Also the stars card. Okay. D four. No, I'm not taking the D four. Actually, does the D4 just reroll my items, or does it reroll everything? Because if it just rerolls my items, then I can take Pandora's box later. Let's give it a shot. So we have Piercing Tears, Proptosis. Oh my god, this is silly. We have Scapegoat. Oh yes, and Mom's Contact. Alright, I'm happy with this. Plus we have the BBF or BFF or whatever the hell it is that is... um explosive fly everywhere. Not a bad thing to do. That worked out for us. And we have Libra, which balanced all our stats. Not bad. Not bad. Doing good. That was a good choice. The adversary is very adversarial. Okay, you know what I need to do? I need to... I'm not gonna make the boss rush. There's no way. There's no way. Yeah, I shouldn't even go. Oh man, and wait a minute. Wait a minute. Do we have the $3 bill? We do have the $3 bill. Okay, that explains it. So yeah, we're not going to make the boss rush. There's no reason to even try. We wasted too much time screwing around, shooting poops and stuff, but that's okay. Pheromones. So I guess we can donate all our money to this count then. And he can give me a really shitty item that I'm not interested in all, in the slightest. I don't take bombs though. Yeah, the adversary, such adversarial, so full of hate. Triple shot, always good. I mean, I miss the fact that I don't have stealth anymore, but that's okay. I do like the fact that I have piercing. I wish I had homing, though. Like, if I still had the homing, that'd be cool. What are you trying to do on this run? Just, uh, going clears for fun? Well, I mean, I'm trying to get achievements, so I'm gonna clear stuff that I haven't cleared yet, which is, um, I think I have to go to the, to the chest on this one. Yeah, I have to go to the chest on this one, so we're gonna go to the chest. Two of diamonds? Alright, if you say so, man. I will certainly double my money. Bombs are key. Eh, that's fine. 
So real quickly, let's donate a bunch of scratch because this is the last shop we have to worry about. Can I get lodged in here? Come on. There we go. So we'll go until it jams and then we'll take the rest of the money for beggars and stuff later. I just like to do the boss rush because it's fun. If that's what you were wondering. I think we have homing tears this room. So let's see, we found our item room. We found our shop. And we were about that. We're done. Let's kill mom with our triple shot. Holy damn it. No, stop it. Stupid keeper head. No, I hate you. Thank you, dry baby. I'm not a fan of Blue Mom, ever. I think we have Explosive Tears, too, which is kind of scary. <gasps> okay, I did take the Polaroid, thank goodness. How did I not get a Devil Oh, because I rerolled my Goat Head. Damn it. Okay. Mostly wondering why you're playing normal instead of hard. Because hard mode gets me killed. I don't, I don't need to play hard mode, and hard mode is not fun. What's the little lumpy follower do? He's a scapegoat. He Enemies go towards him instead of me. Hard mode is not fun for me. So, I mean, I only play it when I'm trying to actually unlock something, like one of the babies. Because I have a massive problem with the game, uh, and its drop rates as it is. I'm very unlucky with them a lot of the time. So, I don't like playing scavenger hunt. It's not fun for me. I'm not going to play on hard mode where the drops are lower. Uh, it's, I feel like it's a bad way to increase difficulty. It doesn't actually make the game harder. It just makes it more frustrating because you're not getting resources like bombs or keys. So, yeah. I'm, oh, damn it. So, I don't intend to play hard mode except for when I'm unlocking stuff. And once I have unlocked said stuff, we're done. I'm not going to do hard mode anymore. Ever. Because there's no fucking reason to. I got plenty of bombs. Interesting. It's not a shop. Because there are no more shops. So what do we have here? We have a vault. You don't say. I, I feel safer doing it this way. Oh, I almost walked into that spike. Thank god I caught it. Almost so so close to walking into that spike. Uh, stop that. So mom's contact this room. That's pretty awesome. We have found... Oh dear. Oh dear. These guys are basically famine. <laughs> They're terrible. Uh, we found our boss room. Which is good. That's what we wanted. So you're only aiming for the heart kills that unlock the baby achievements on hard mode? Hold on. Or rather than hard mode on all bosses. I will do them probably for completion, and then be done with it. Like I said, I don't think it's fun. I'm not liking shit. There goes our double enchants. Damn you, Proptosis. You screwed me. Anyway. But yeah, I'll probably do it one... You know, one boss kill of each character, just because, you know, OCD gotta get it one billion percent. But, yeah, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna play hard mode like some people do, because I don't think it's fun. And, you know... It's just like my opinion, man. This is a suck thing about carrying Pandora's box around. I can't, like, use it and get charges and stuff. <clears throat> Excuse me. Whoa, you are not supposed to do that. 
Well, you are, because you're programmed to, but it sucks. <clears throat> Excuse me. You know what? I don't even care about the double room here, so... Yep. No reason to. What pills are these? Oh, nice! Got a soul heart out of that. Puberty, that kinda sucks. Means there's three puberty bills in this room. And tears up! Nice! Oh, come on! Really? <laughs> Lumps can go fuck themselves. Because I hate them. Ow. I have an itch in my eye. One sec. Alright, game. Throw me a bone here. I'm beginning to regret my decision to reroll all of my items with the D4. I'm beginning to regret it. Because, I mean, while I got, like, proptosis, which is really good, I don't have the range to back it up. I don't. At all. Hey, scythes! Which is doubly silly since I haven't technically unlocked these yet. Mm, thank goodness for mom's contact. Alright, let's fight mom! Thank goodness for my scapegoat. So I'm just going to let my dry baby sit right in front of me to suck up tears so that I don't get hit. Thank you, dry baby. Oh, oh, oh. No, I need you. I need you, tear shield. Okay, there we go. So, up to the cathedral we go. <clears throat> I mean, don't you have to do all the bosses on hard mode for, um, for a real platinum god anyway? Bombs are key. Right, hold on to that. I'm not going to use it. I'll hold on to it. Oh, right, I need to use the Pandora's box here. Oh, give me the fucking Bible. Are you kidding me? Worst fucking item it could have given me. Worst fucking item from the God or Pool. Alright, well, there's a Guppy item, so... Yeah, then I'll do each of them once. And that'll be that. <clears throat> but I don't plan to do it any more than that, because it's not fun. Missed some chest. Let's go back and get that. So yeah, I'll do ex I'll do it exactly enough times to unlock real platinum god, and then never again. Oh my god! Look at all these psychic corpses. It's crazy. What's oh, such a fucking worthless devil or angel? Am I um? Hey, little haunts. I'm gonna murder you. I'll do it. Okay, worth. Super worth. Ow. Alright, and we have the habit, which makes it even more worth it. Nice.
Uh, no, I don't want that. Leave me alone. Don't, don't do this to me. Have you had any luck with the no damage achievements? Uh, I think I've gotten all of them, except for maybe Dark Boy. But I got them really early on on Azazel runs, so, you know, I might as well have cheesed them. I might have gotten Dark Boy even. I'd have to. I'd have to go look. I don't know off the top of my head. Each and every individual part of you. Because you guys suck. Fucking whale. Come on, don't don't do this shit to me. Azazel is OP and managed to get Dark and Dark Boy and Dead Boy with a really good guppy build and Mama's Boy with Homing Brim. Yeah, that sounds about right. Azazel is too good in most situations, but that's okay, because he's awesome. I'm glad I got them out of the way and I don't have to worry about them anymore. I would love to get money equals power right now. <gasps> That'll do. And that will do too. Nice. Oh, really? So now that that's done, let's fight Isaac. Oh yeah, homing on this room. Awesome. Actually pretty good. So just like before, I'm gonna kinda chill out behind Dry Baby. He's gonna be my save, y'all. He's gonna be awesome. And I'll just slowly chip away at Isaac's health right here. Oh, really? Come on. Oh, boy. Whew. One sec. I'll read, I'll read chat in a minute. Oh, damn it. Didn't get far enough away. Got no Dark Boy on November 6th. Okay, I couldn't remember. Oh yay, we won. Thank goodness. So we got Bloody Lust finally unlocked. Alright, but after you had that no damage, you went to the room. You had the achievement, you went to the room with no damage. Good. So Bloody Lust has appeared in the basement. Hell yeah, unlocks. Slowly getting them. Alright, Infestation 2, Ares, PhD, Robo Baby 2.0. These are mostly terrible items. And I'm only going to take them because, like, my choices are this or nothing. Because I don't have the D6. So, whatever. Oh, come on. I just want to win this. Please don't fuck me over. Really wish I had Guppy's tail right now. And a second uh, trinket, because I managed to go through this whole time totally able to pick up a second trinket, and I never got one. I've been using the same coin since, like, the beginning of the game. You dry baby, you are like my hero lately. He really is my hero. I don't know how I dodged that.
guess because I didn't. <laughs> Come on, give me like something. Give me a chest. Please. Trying to make sure that I use Robo Baby 2.0 as well as everything else. Whoa! Dip, please. Alright, Empress card, really good for later. But in the meantime, let's fight the Super Sloth. Infestation 2 is really good in this sense because, you know, we're spawning s spiders every time we kill something. He looks kind of like a fucked up rabbit now. Oh my god. He's he's from Watership Down. That's all there is to it. Have I mentioned how much the adversary can fuck off? Because I hate him. He's just... He's terrible. He's the worst. Thanks for the half heart, buddy. Why am I not getting double half hearts? Did I lose my contract from below? I think I did in the reroll. I shouldn't have rerolled it. I shouldn't have. I'd be more powerful without the reroll. Oh well. Fire's remorse. Oh wait, that there's a door over there. Didn't see one at first. Cause like my tier rate, my damage, none of it is particularly special. This is kind of a pretty damn mediocre build. I, it just kind of exists. I mean, it would probably beat Blue Baby, but only because I have Dry Baby to stand there and block all the tiers and stuff. You think you're more afraid of the bloat than the adversary? Yes and no. That's not supposed to happen. They were supposed to have taken out rooms where you enter from the top and fight Gertie. I thought they took those out. Alright, what do we got here? Pheromones. Don't care. I'd rather keep this one. Alright, use the Empress card. And now we're just gonna plink him. We're going to plink him. It's going to be wonderful. If you don't know what plinking is, I can explain. It's... <laughs> oh. Such a silly term. Plinking. It's supposed to be like where a melee character just takes like a throwing dagger and kills an enemy by just throwing knives at it from far away where it can't reach you from a safe spot. It doesn't take much skill. It's kind of cheesy. You just hang out in the back corner and, you know, stuff. Awesome! We win! We unlock the bloody penny! Plink success! And I'm not going to watch, we're not going to watch the, the cutscene because it's uh, loud and annoying. So, we've unlocked the bloody penny. Thank goodness. So that's two more runs with, or two more achievements with Samson taken care of. I think we've only got 30 left now, if I'm, if I'm correct, which I might not be. Either way, I hope you enjoyed. We won. Hell yes. Um, if you did like it, do that whole like and subscribe thing. If you didn't, well, you don't have to. I understand. But I will see you guys next time. Have a good night, everyone. Bye.